Doctors, what's the most mysterious medical case you've ever solved? I'm not a doctor. I'm a genetic counselor in pediatric oncology. This isn't exactly a what could it be kind of mystery, but more of a trust your gut story. A baby came to our clinic with a brain tumor. Initially, I was told there was no family history of cancer, but when I sat down and talked with the mother, I found out she had breast cancer in her early 20s, and her own mother had died at the same age from a rare sarcoma. As I kept asking questions, it turned out that every woman on the maternal side of the family had developed some form of cancer at a young age. All the standard genetic and tumor tests for both mother and child came back negative. Normally, that's where most people would stop and say, well, science doesn't have all the answers yet, but something about this family just screamed that there was a hidden link. So I ordered sequencing for one specific gene, but this time using whole genome deep sequencing, which looks way deeper than regular tests. Labs usually don't go that far because the odds of finding anything are microscopic, especially in the so-called junk DNA sections that don't code for proteins. And guess what? We found a mutation deep inside an intron of that gene, the smoking gun. It explained both the baby's tumor and the family's cancer history. The result was devastating, a rare condition called lee frau meni syndrome, where the lifetime risk of developing almost any type of cancer is nearly 100%. Still, it gave the family family answers and allowed us to test other relatives, identify carriers, and literally save lives through early screening. It also made me even more paranoid, in a good way. Every time a test comes back negative, I can't help but think, is it really negative? And that keeps pushing me to dig deeper for my patients, especially the little ones who can't speak for themselves.